Hi, I'm Andy McGivern, Curator of Exhibitions at the Woodson Art Museum and Guest Curator for Explorations in Wood, Selections from the Center for Art in Wood. I've worked with the Center for Art in Wood, formerly the Wood Turning Center of Philadelphia, on three different occasions beginning in 1994, as we've hosted their exhibitions. Explorations in Wood offers a variety of traditional vessel forms, like Bob Stocksdale's Macadamia Bowl and Alan Reitzman's Walnut Vase. The exhibition also features more sculptural forms, like Mark Bishop's Split Sphere II and Derek Weedman's Mandrill in carved and painted box elder. Some of the works are delicate pieces that could fit in the palm of your hand, like Dale Chase's lidded container in African blackwood, and Malcolm Zander's blackwood heart with its intricately carved lattice rim. Equally impressive in scale is Marcus Tatton's Pitson Amphor, which tops out at 54 inches tall. Ted Hunter's Once Upon a Sandbank, carved in cherry, is also surprisingly larger than one might expect if first viewed in a photograph. As you explore the galleries, take note of the variety of surface treatments achieved by the artists. While some are textured by carving, others are blackened through burning and others yet are painted, such as Liz and Michael O'Donnell's Bird Bowl, featuring a carefully turned form with a beautifully painted rim and painted egg shapes in the bowl's interior. One thing is for certain, the level of craftsmanship and sophisticated designs showcased in Explorations in Wood is a testament to the Center for Art in Wood and their commitment to fostering creativity and technical achievement in the rich medium of wood. I hope you enjoy the exhibition.